Hi guys, welcome to my channel Or should I say welcome back to my channel <laughs> I know, I know that I have been gone for a really 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 long time I have been absolutely MIA from here But it... Are you freaking kidding me? I just filmed this same video in Spanish Everything was so quiet and so peaceful But in just right in the moment that I wanted to film it in English the guys over there decided to make noise but anyways okay i'm kind of nervous because i know that i have been gone for a really really long time if you have been actually following me in my instagram account you can say that i was really active there but if you don't know you don't follow me there well here i am to update you that probably most of you from here you know me as on the opener yeah. but i'm not opener anymore I finished my two year, my two opera years in October 14th Even though it was kind of sad for me I am really excited because I know that some exciting new things are coming my way And I can't wait But uh, yeah So I decided that since I was having a little bit more of free time I was gonna start filming videos for YouTube Not only for Instagram but for YouTube too so I posted a picture announcing that I was actually gonna get into YouTube again and I told you guys to ask me any questions that you wanted and right now I'm gonna answer them but before I answer them I gotta say that please forgive my accent <laughs> uh, for the longest time I was like holding myself back to do this kind of videos because it includes me talking so it is kind of uh, not weird but challenging for me because I have to speak English and I have to be like really careful with my words because otherwise you're not going to understand me and I have to talk like really really slow so you can understand my accent not only the English but my accent with it because my accent sometimes it gets really thick and it's just horrible especially when i get so nervous you will see in any video or even in this first video you will see when my accent gets really really thick it's because i'm starting to get nervous so there you go you already know something about me <laughs> before i answer all your questions I would like to update you about my life a little bit, what was going on and all of that because I know that probably of you have been following from the beginning and I think that I would like to let you know what I was doing. I am not an opera anymore, probably most of you know that, well, I'm engaged. He proposed. I don't have any video. He broke to someone that likes to keep all that kind of stuff low profile, but it was pretty cute, I gotta say. I cried. So that means that it was really really cute and he was nice and he was romantic and all that kind of stuff but yeah he's a marine so he had to move from california to new york and we decided that we were gonna take the challenge we we're gonna take the experience that we will just come and live here in new york which is something really 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 new to me because i'm from ecuador and in ecuador we don't have a snow winter is not a thing even though we do have it but it's not like this so right now i'm freezing my butt off like it's crazy but anyways what i was saying we moved from california to new york um we did it by car brooks drove all the way i know crazy and we also brought Lily. We are trying to get used to the new neighborhood, to the neighbors, and all the new things that we have ahead. Now I'm gonna go ahead and answer a few of your questions that you left below the picture that I posted in my Instagram. How cool! I'm so glad you made one. I'll be so happy to send. I was one of your first subscribers once you hit a, once you hit a million, which I know it would be soon. Oh, you're so sweet. Thank you so much. Um. Uh, my question is how old are you and how long have you been doing makeup? So I'm 22 years old even though I don't look like it. I have been doing makeup uh, for about, I don't know, I started when I was like 18, 19, kinda, sort of. 
meaning of your cross tattoo and if there are any other ones. Uh, my cross tattoo is actually a representation, you can say, uh, of my dad. Sadly, he passed away when I was three years old. This cross is just my way to, to have him even closer to me. I also have um, his name by my ribs and I have another tattoo in my back. Hi Anna, I'm so glad that you are going back to your channel. I would like to know how was your experience as an oper and what are you doing now? Kisses from Colombia. So sweet, thank you so much. This is for you too. Maybe the most of you know that's why I came to the United States. It was actually really nice. I mean, it was really sad because I was leaving my 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 baby. They are like my babies. Those kids are so so cute. Even though they are little devils, I gotta say they are little devils. But I love them so so much. So it was sad to leave them. Um, but I am happy because I know that I have new experience coming my way and I'm really 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 excited about the Hay House family they were a great host family I mean they were like perfect and what am I up to right now? what am I doing? what am I supposed to do right now that I'm done? Um, I would like to say that uh, I am trying to put more time into YouTube because I know that I've been doing a lot, a lot of Instagram and um, as I already said one of the things that were holding me back was my English, but here I am trying to get past that thing. But now that I have more time, I'm gonna be doing this. Taking this like a little bit more seriously, if you can say that, something like it. Um, I don't, I'm not taking it as a job, I don't really know how it works as a job. But if it comes down to it, to be my job, I would love to do it. But I do have a part-time job. Uh, which, uh, which is good because obviously I need money. I mean, I cannot survive out of the air. Like, no. Someone says, I miss your Oprah videos, but I'm so happy for you and for this new YouTube channel. Oh, thank you so much. It is in Spanish, so let me see. But she's basically asking if I'm gonna study again. And uh, yeah, definitely, yeah. Back home. I was studying and to become an au pair and come here to the United States I had to leave my studies and it's something not that I regret but I would absolutely love to study again and I would like to study international business Are you gonna say to live in the United States? Uh, how do you learn to do makeup, to do your own makeup? I don't know how long I'm gonna stay here in the United States I mean, Brooks and I are gonna get married so I am definitely staying in the United States but I wouldn't say it will be forever. I would like to somehow go back to Ecuador and live there, but uh, I don't know when it's gonna happen or if it is gonna happen. How I'll learn how to do my makeup. All of us can say thank you to my mom, please. Because like uh, when I got out of high school, I was not so girly, if you can say. My mom made me to get into a model school, like makeup school and all this girly things and all of that so definitely thank you mom i didn't like it at the beginning but now i'm really thankful because i'm doing this and i love this i am so excited that you have a youtube channel now i just love your makeup tutorials thank you hi and i'm thank i'm thankful that you have a youtube account now i just want to ask can you do a little tour of your makeup collection um i don't know why you guys think that i have a real big like makeup collection or something like that. I don't. I don't have a lot of makeup. I have like my own makeup, like personal makeup and all of that. Um, but yeah, I don't have a lot. I do makeup on people now. I just don't do it like as a professional thing because uh, as, as I already said, I don't have a lot of makeup. But uh, if you live in New York and you actually want me to do your makeup, you can just go ahead and shoot me an email and we can get in contact and we can talk about it yes i was waiting for this moment my questions are which i which agency do you use to be an oper and what's your next plan in the city the agency in my country is called oper world ecuador but here in the united states uh it is go oper and my plan uh in the, in the city as i already said for the moment it's just doing this working part-time and that's it when are you getting married um teach me how to do my makeup of course 
that's what I am doing here, girl. Trying to teach you guys the little things that I know because it is not like I know a lot. Please, in Spanish. Every single time that I upload, there are gonna be two videos. Probably there are gonna be some times where I'm gonna be just speaking English and I'm gonna have subtitles. So I hope that you don't mind. I'm gonna try to not post those videos so often because I really wanna try to post two videos of the same thing in Spanish and in English. And are you not an helper anymore? Nope, I'm not an helper anymore. Like, even though I'm not an helper anymore, if you have any question or something like that, just go ahead, ask me. I will absolutely gladly answer it for you. But I have two persons here that are helpers. I have a male helper and a female helper. So if you guys are really, really, really want to ask, to someone else besides me, you can ask them. Their names are Samuel and Natalie. I will link all, all, all their links and all those fun stuff in my description box. And the last question. We'll love to know how a parent went and when are you getting married? Being an opera was one of the best decisions of my life. Like, hands down. It was absolutely good to be able to get out of my country, get to know new people. And yeah, so that's everything for today, guys. Um, thank you, thank you so much for watching. I'm really glad that I'm doing this again. I feel so, it feels so good to be able to talk to you guys, even though it is in English. And I still feel nervous. If you hear that my English is getting thick, it's because I'm getting really, really nervous. Thank you, thank you so much, guys, for all, all the support. Your guys' comments in my Instagrams are live. Like, they give me so much positive energy honestly and for you guys is that i'm doing this and i hope that you guys really like it this channel is not only mine but yours so just let me know down below in the comments what do you want to see next what kind of makeup what what kind of stuff you want to see i'm here to please all of you if you're new please please don't forget to subscribe to my channel please thumbs up to this video if you did like it and if you didn't well just go ahead and go to the next video. Huge favor that I'm gonna ask to you guys is please, please, I would like to see if we can get to 5,000 subscribers by the end of the year. I know it's really, really late, but I'm pretty sure that we can make it. I'm at 4,000, but just go ahead and tell your friends to subscribe to my channel so we can grow and be bigger and bigger and bigger. I won't have a schedule just yet, because I don't want to let you guys down and say I'm going to upload this day and I don't. But I'm absolutely going to try to do it more often. And I think that now that's everything. Bye-bye, guys. See you in my next video.